right. Ah. Hello, everybody. You are here. I am here. But where is Jane? Ooh, let's try it again. Hello, everybody. You are here. I am here. But that's not Jane, isn't it? I keep lamenting so much about the details of Hogwarts Legacy that I just wanted to show you something that I encountered with my second character that I used to play privately because I can't leave the fingers of that game. And this character, as you might assume, is a Gryffindor. So today we are going to see not only their common room, but one little detail that I absolutely oi, 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 that I absolutely love. Sorry, made a mess there. Made a mess there. The recording starts absolutely great. Um, so let's leave our common room. I just saw Peeves here, who luckily is gone by now. Let's get down. Ooh. Hello, Mr. Knight. Hello, Mr. Knight. And there we go. Into the Gryffindor's common room. I've never been here, though. Hello, Nicholas. Now see, this is coziness and a little loading arrow, but mainly coziness. And I have to say, I played the game yesterday privately and the performance has vastly improved. Um, second thing is that is, which is really nice. First of all, all those portraits here. Hello, mister. Hello, other mister. Jesus Christ. You don't know much about fashion, but neither do I. Um, this character is a male character, and so while Jane can access every sleeping room Handy she wants to, he I won't be going up there. cannot. That's the little details, or the big details, whatever. I just can't get there. So, sorry buddy. No action for you tonight. Anyways, here we are in the Gryffindor common room and look at how beautifully cozy it is. This is, yeah, the, the Hufflepuff common room is a bit more, um, what do you call it, claustrophobic. Um, under the ground, also very, very cozy, looks like a hobbit home, but this one just straight out of the movies. So, if we leave here... Oh, I think it's it's ah, <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> wrong spell, wrong spell. There we go. Lumos. If we leave here, now of course, unfortunately, it's getting night. Through this little, what's it called? A pipe or whatever. Here is the fat lady. Those two. No, no, hey, fat lady, get away. I'm just trying to, to see what that picture shows us. She seems to be ill, and he is tending to her. Another picture. With a little platypus! So much stuff to see! Isn't that amazing? Isn't that amazing at all? I think we know him from another picture. And there we go, Abraham Lincoln in Hogwarts Legacy. So much history, so much history. And yeah, what I wanted to show you though, is it's all about the little things in the game. If we go down and it will be a bit harder for me to find the way because it's night. But yeah, there we go, there we go. And here by the way is the witch with the, that is half blind. Um which offers us a secret passage that leads us to Hogsmeade. And it's again so freaking cool to finally see all of that, um, all of those things that we read about, that we heard about in the audiobooks or whatever, that we've seen in the movies. And now finally they are here. What I, however, want to do... I cannot imagine that, lady. You are absolutely right, but I don't really try to imagine as well. We are going down and you might be familiar with that passage because down here is the kitchen. So where could we be going? Wait. Oh, also, let me show you the kitchen because as a Gryffindor, 
Some of the missions are different, like as the Gryffindor character, we've never been to Azkaban, however, we've been to the Hogwarts kitchen. But I guess all of the house elves that worked here during the day are now asleep. Look at that. Hogwarts kitchen. <laughs> and now they're doing the dishes. Oh god, this is so cool. The last time I was here. Oh, and they, they prepared breakfast. The house elves in the kitchen prepared breakfast. This is insane. And here's where they live, by the way, in those barrels. This is absolutely insane. Um, the level of detail. I... I can't even... It's... Wow. Wait. Trying not to cause them any more... Um... Any more work. Oh god. Scrubbing. So yeah. As a Gryffindor, I'm allowed to see the kitchen. However, as a Gryffindor, what I'm not allowed to do is... Here, you might be familiar with those badgers and with that barrel. So, whose common room is that? However, if I go close, I'm getting sprayed with vinegar. <laughs> Isn't that amazing? Isn't that amazing? That's all that I wanted to show you. Lumos. Now, I wonder what Jane is doing. And that is where Jane is. She is also in the... My brain all of a sudden stopped working in the company of a house elf. She is in the company of a house elf. And you are in the company of a dimwit. <laughs> However, Mrs. Weasley, any advice about how to improve our brain performance? Let me know. I'm ready for the next lesson, Professor. Very well. First, you'll need to gather some moonstone. You can acquire it by vanishing items here in the Room of Requirement, or you can gather it carefully outside of the Hogwarts grounds. Return to me once you've gathered enough, and we shall begin the lesson. We definitely shall begin the lesson. I want to about transfiguration, if you have a moment. Yeah, yeah, sure. Sure, sure. I have the moonstone you requested, Professor. Good. Then we may begin your lesson. You can conjure more than potions and herbology tables. Conjuration can be used to decorate this space to your liking. Why don't you try it on the walls and floor? Yeah, why not? I will conjure the hell out of that room, I tell you that. Um, by the way, how does it work? Um, first we switch and... Is... Oh, sorry, oh sorry. Deke thinks perhaps you didn't know Deke was near. Oh, sorry, really? <laughs> I am sorry, Deke. <laughs> oh god, he is so cute. <laughs> I am so sorry. I didn't mean to. So, let's conjure. Potions, herbology. I want to conjure something cool. Nah, no, not a rock. Furniture. Okay. Um, what could we do? Maybe... A Quidditch board, yeah, that's obviously the most important thing. Um, by the way, where is the entrance? Is that the entrance to the room? Because I want that to be super duper present. So if that is the entrance, then let's put the Quidditch board somewhere here. No? I guess we're not putting it somewhere there. Let's put it here. Bam! Yeah, and another one. Um, not necessarily. What's that? A long mirror? No. We don't need a mirror. Um, so many mirrors. That looks really, really cool. Is that a shelf for the wall? There's, there's a skull. We're a Huff Hufflepuff. We're afraid of skulls. Decoration. All in for that. Oh, look! There we go! Can I build five of those? Please! And they even make it more bright. So, yeah, that's enough, I guess. Statues! A statue of myself, please. Can't. 
I can't. We could have a little table though, but I think for now... Seating. Oh. Shall we have a little table? Make it a bit more cozy for us? Not now. Maybe later. Maybe later. When we acquired more items. And oh, look! Here, the teapot. And the magnifying glass. Oh, and Abe Lincoln! We just saw him! And, and the guy who is... I'm um, tending to his girlfriend or daughter. I don't know what it is. Could be everything. Um, no assumption and no judgment here. And the girl with the platypus! Yeah, those are the best paintings in the world. And that's why they um, appear in the room of requirement. So, Miss Weasley. Professor, I have some questions about conjuration. Yes? I don't have any questions after all. There are so many choices. What items do you think I should conjure? I shall leave that entirely up to you. This is your space after all. I will say that a simple addition such as a wall hanging or a portrait might make the space feel unique. Yeah? Can I remove an item I've conjured? Indeed you can. You yeah, already can. know the spell. Wow. Evanesco. When you vanish something, the moonstone used to conjure it will become available to you again. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I think I can manage from here. Thank you. I look forward to seeing your work. Uh, you're not going to be invited here. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> that's... Oh. Hello, lady. Um, where, where's Deke? Deeky Popiki. Can I talk to you? Oh, he's so cute. Look at the little apple that he's eating for like about half an hour. Astronomy Tower. Let's go. And what we are going to see after the loading time, which by the way, I don't know if you noticed, but loading, no loading times you cannot notice because I always cut them out because I'm a nice YouTuber and I love you. Um, but the performance has increased vastly, like really, really good. They made huge steps forward. I'm playing on very old hot hardware hard hardware um and it's gotten much much better than initially so yeah but in summer i guess i will get a hardware upgrade and look here barnabas the fool with his trolls that he is trying to teach oh how do you do that okay um it's loading the old castle so Barnabas the Barmy. So trying to teach ballet to the trolls. <laughs> and isn't that amazing? I mean, you've heard about it in the in the um in the movies or you've seen it in the books. And now there we go. There's a statue. Hello, mister. So what we are going to do now, um, since I don't really know what our next quest is. I want to pay a visit to the Gryffindor common room and see what happens. Ooh, galaxy! Galaxy! That reminds me of Smash Ball. And that reminds me of reminding you to freaking buy the game. Because it's the best game in the world. Anyways, let's get down here. And who are you? Oh, common hu- uh, Yeah, Hufflepuff. Um, student. Hogwarts always has another mystery to discover. If I don't find a way to concentrate, I'll fail my owl to the certain. Uh, sure, sure. Are you... Uh, that was the lady that we um, just got the gobstones for, right? What was her name? Nati or Nasi? I don't know. I, I don't even remember her name. But she was being poor. So, so much I do remember. So, where are we? I have no freaking idea. That is still a part of the castle that I don't have any clues about. Um, we could ask him for instruction, but we are definitely way too proud to do so. And let's see it's if... Here we go. Yeah. Field guide pages. Collector. All right. All right, all right, all right. 